Hello everybody, my name is Andy, you can call me Bundy, and welcome back to Diddy Kong Racing for the Nintendo 64. We, last episode, started Sherbet Island, got all of these pretty levels, got the TT amulet piece for this level, and beat the boss. Now we are going to do the silver coin challenges for Sherbet Island, starting with Whale Bay. Hopefully I'll remember all these. Okay. See if we can get them all first lap again. Alright, there's one. Oh, missed it. So much for that. As long as I can find them all, I think that, that'll be a good thing. Boom. Sorry, Diddy. Every time I think of Diddy, um, my roommate from last year, every time he would bring up Diddy Kong, he's like, IDK, Diddy? So, like talking about Donkey Kong and then Diddy Kong in the same sentence. Why am I sucking so bad? Oh yeah, silver coins. Um, I'm going to use that as an excuse. Now that they're done, I have a whole lap and a half to uh, dominate, which I'm in second place, so that shouldn't be uh, too miserable. Luckily, this isn't like Adventure 2 where it's like ridiculous. Uh, I look like an idiot doing that too. I actually don't know if that helps. I feel like it should, especially with the uh, foam and stuff that it shows. But no, nope, that's just like that all the time. Um, <laughs> I really like the tropical levels, especially when I'm playing in the winter time because it's so cold outside and snowy and we just did a snow level. Don't need that from real life. All right, moving on. Next level, we've got Crescent Island, which you can't actually get, well, you could, but it wouldn't be practical to get all of the coins the first lap because of this first split in the level. Alright. See, there's one right here, and then there's one right there, but there's also one in that little cave right there. Uh, we got one over yonder here, and... I believe there's one, yeah, right over here, and then go up this little alcove, or this ladder ramp thing, that's what it's called. Okay, there's a thingy over here, and we go into this little shortcut, we got all but one, I wonder where that one could be. Oh, it's over here. Spoilers. Sweet! Also, I find it really funny that, um, and now that I think about it, I didn't think about it before, but all of the introductory video, there are like different levels from the game. Go figure. Um, so the, when, you, when Banjo is introduced, he's in the plane and he's in Crescent Island and he knocks over Crunchy in that little alcove, actually. Go, Banjo, go. Phew! moderately satisfying when I do that. Just get all the max uh, rockets and then shoot them all just for the heck of it. Alright, moving right along. I love how I, I, I didn't even think about it. You can actually turn those arrows off. I usually do. Well, I used to. Maybe I don't anymore. But for some reason I haven't. Um. I don't know. This is making it... <clears throat> Today is feeling very, very easy to do um, stuff like this. But we're going to have to do this, all these levels, one more time in this part. So now here we go. Here we go with Pirate Lagoon. Okay. Get ready. Go. Okay. All right, one. I actually don't remember the last time I did Pirate Lagoon. Silver coin. There's one over. Yep. Okay. Um, I'm trying not to be too focused on this. Well, at the same time, not sucking too terribly. I'm missing one. No, I got them all first lap. I actually thought I missed one. Like over here. Like I thought there'd be one over there. But there isn't. Hallelujah. Um 
yeah, I really don't know what to say about these water levels because there's, as, I, as I've mentioned previously, these are not my favorite, so I'm just kind of like, just going along with the flow, not gonna care too much about, oh gosh, apparently nobody used my oil slick, that's sad. Um, I was kind of like jamming with the music and I just got a, I, 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 this is pro probably bad on my part that I just started recording right after class because I'm kind of drained from the day. So that's a thing. Uh, next is treasure caves, treasure caves, treasure caves, whatever. And all right, got one, got two. <clears throat> Very exciting commentary right here. Three. I can count to eight. Cause there's four. <laughs> Five. Six. Ooh. Seven. Eight. Ha! I just pulled this impressive, but not impressive feat. Oh, dang it, Diddy. Conquer. I'm watching you. So jazzy. Not. I mean. Ooh. You. I don't. I. Don't, I guess I wouldn't consider this jazzy. I guess. I. I don't know. What would you consider this music? It's really peppy and. Do, 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 do. I don't know. Huh. I mean, other than soundtrack. Let's go under the video game soundtrack genre. It's not technically a genre, but it's a genre. I actually have most of my uh, Google Play Music soundtracks listed as a video game soundtrack because not all video game soundtracks are the same, let's be honest here. Okay, moving on. Wait, does that mean... Oh gosh. No. Boss time again. Ah. <laughs> I don't wanna, but I'm going to. I hate this one because what's the power up for the spike? It's the bubble. Yeah. Oh ha ha ha. We get a special prize. I'm excited for a special prize. Ooh, that that hurt me. I'm never no no. Okay. Let's go. Let's go, Bundy. You got this. Banjo, you got this too. Nope. That is why I hate this level. With a passion. Okay. Also, they're everywhere. Like, seriously. Okay. And over here. Let's get ourselves our homing missile. And shoot the crap out of the octopus. Boom, boom. Also, kudos to whoever did the voice for this uh, octopus because holy crap, the blah, 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 blah. It gets me every time. All right. I really don't have any like idea how to keep this exciting, especially because the octopus sucks. Don't, don't hurt me, please. All right. I really hope this actually works because I'm doing it. Boom. Well, this was anticlimactic, wasn't it? Well then, huh? I feel better about myself. I must have evolved as a gamer. Well, shrimp. I'm like half. Your oh wait, that's why. He's also the creepiest sounding of all of the four bosses. I mean, the first one kind of sounds like this. The second one sounds like this. And this one's like blah 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 blah. <laughs> Just one more piece of the amulet left. Soon you'll be ready for Wizbig. You can do it. Ugh. Oh. 
Okay, next is trophy race. We'll do the trophy race in it. It's okay. Come on. Pew. Into the tro trophy race. Can't jump onto the thing. That makes me sad. Alright, now let's just kind of blast through Whale Bay. Well, all the levels, but first is Whale Bay. Alright. Oh, I didn't get the balloon? Seriously? Surfsla? Oh, don't you dare, Diddy. That's why I like to jump up above onto this thing, because it's a little tiny bit of a shortcut. Sort of. Uh, I don't know if the AI gets harder or what. I mean, obviously they it probably do for uh, difficulty things, but the trophy races are a little bit tougher than... Uh, Say the first time you do the level. Alright. So just hit every single zipper bundy and you should be fine. I don't under Also, can whales are the ones that need to breathe and oh gosh. That's why I don't have any bananas. I have zero bananas. And you get speed by having bananas. Up to ten. You can get more than ten, but only ten affect you issue but we're done with that one maybe I'll fix it for this next one maybe wait I thought Crescent Island was next apparently not get the hovercraft levels out of the way that's that's actually very interesting too this is the first time we see that the level orders off because Balloon-wise, Crescent Island should have been next, but it wasn't. Instead, we got uh, this one. And... I don't know why I'm in such a, like, a sound effect mood today, but I am. And we are going to truck along with the... Uh, I really don't like using the hovercraft either, so that doesn't help that... Uh, these first two levels are nothing but hovercraft because, surprise, we're in the tropics. There's a lot of water. Uh, I don't actually, yeah, I think this is one of the levels too where you can only use hover. I'm pretty sure you can actually use hover for most, if not all, levels. Except for maybe a couple of the, uh, a couple levels. I'm not sure which ones, honestly. I'm gonna have to check into that. Alright, next one. Crescent Island. Okay, next. Alright, one, two, three, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three. <laughs> um, oh gosh, what was I what was I thinking of right there? One, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. I don't even I can't think. Wow, my mind has gone blank. Really quickly, more than fa faster than normal. Oh no, Bundy's getting old. Oh, crud. Don't do that, Banjo! I trusted you! Okay. Okay. Seriously, Diddy? Seriously? I don't even know anymore. Thank you for that. Alright. Um... Uh... Yeah, there's like people who are insane at this game. I've mentioned them a lot before, and just watching them play, it's really inspiring. But I'm like, I can't devote enough time to learn all the routes and stuff like that, like they have for this game. I just want to win, beat the game. The nice part for me is that there's no rubber band AI, so it's, oh no, that was, I saw that coming. Couldn't avoid it. Um, but yeah, it's just, ugh, how do people spend, I mean, one of the guys that I know who does it, he's also a math teacher and stuff like that, so I guess having that, uh, kind of mentality makes it really easy, mathematics, sim-wise, and whatnot. Wow, I did not do that great, that bit, that, 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 that world. Treasure cave, we're almost there. We're getting there. Oh my gosh. Get ready. 
Finally. Oh, dang it. All right, let's get some of the bananas. Banjo doesn't eat bananas, does he? Well, he does now. Actually, they just store, they just store them because if you get hit, you lose them. So I guess you don't. They they, they power the carts. Maybe. I'm trying to come up with a reason for bananas other than the fact that it's a Diddy Kong game. Also, oh here we go. I haven't gotten ten banana. Ten bananas in a while. Um, in the D DS version of this game, it actually gives you a little bit of a story beforehand of like why Wizpig and why the story and whatnot, because you didn't have the manual like everybody did back when Nintendo games were popular. Nintendo 64 games were popular, but basically show like them sending messages and Diddy Kong being like, Oh, I'm gonna save the day! Meh. Okay, we're almost done. We are done. And let's see who, who, how do we do? Diddy Kong came in a not so close second, then Bumper, Crunch, Timber, Conquer, Tipsy, and finally Tipped Up with nothing. Poor Tipped Up. <laughs> Shit, tear was shed. <sighs> okay. Da ba da ba, ba da ba da ba da ba. Okay. But we have now finished all of Sherbert Island. So next time, well, let's look. I, I don't. Did I do all the challenges? We're gonna go outside and check. Yes, we did. So next time, we are going to be going to the last level before we go to Whizpig. So next time, my name is Andy. You can call me Bundy. Go ahead and leave a like, leave a comment. Uh, let me know what kind of uh, wh who your favorite character is in this game. So I will see you in the next time. Next in the next time. Bye.